It's unboxing time, so you know what that means. Cow hat. So two disclaimers before I start this video. Um, I was just at the dentist and I had to get a cavity filled, so like this half of my face is numb, so if I can't pronounce words, that's why. And two, I've had this for almost a month now and I have not been able to open it just because if, if you've been tracking with my Instagram, everything that's happened with the Owl's house, uh, that basically is no longer uh, the basement flooded and it's kind of irreversible. There's black mold down there. So moved everything out uh, back here. So yeah, it's a bummer, but what are you gonna do? Uh, so I'm back to my regular schedule and I'm super excited to open this up because I have had this for too long, <laughs> so. So DuckDex is an awesome company. If you're not uh, familiar with Savannah, definitely uh, check out her uh, social links. I'll put those in the description below. But yeah, these are uh, 3D printed boards and they're see-through. And then this is also, I think the first ones that, this is the third release and this is the first one that came with the ducky tape, which is also see-through grip. So I'm super excited to open this. So let's get into it. That out of the way. Wow. That is cool. It's different when you see it online versus when you see it in person. This is awesome. All right, so let's uh, get this open. So yeah, the package just comes with the, um, just comes with the deck. So first off, we got the backing for that. Tips for applying ducky tape. For the best appearance to avoid air bubbles and fingerprints on the adhesive can show through the tape. To prevent this, apply the tape slowly and carefully with lots of pressure. Do not peel up tape to reposition since the tape is transparent, it can leave marks of adhesive. Interesting. Use a razor blade to cut off the excess, not a file. It's good advice, I totally would've used a file. That is an interesting texture. I'm excited to see how that works. All right, so first up, the deck basically feels a little bit heavier than a normal fingerboard, uh, and it's definitely a little bit thicker. Ooh, and it flexes too. That is cool. That is so cool. How is it? I will never understand how this was made. This is awesome. I'm so excited to set this up, so. All right, let's, uh, let me get some trucks on this board and then we can go. All right. All right, so, so I did a pretty rough job, but uh, I think it should be kind of fun. So let's try it out. Right off the bat, this is uh, definitely unique. It's definitely heavier than a normal fingerboard, but also like when it lands, the sound is like, I mean, it, it bounces because it flexes. Like in comparison to like, I don't know. That's not that crazy, but I think it's pretty cool. So yeah, I definitely think that this is uh, gonna be a fingerboard that I use a lot. I'm gonna try out different uh, different setups and stuff, different wheels maybe, and uh, try to try it out on like, vert street stuff like that so i'm definitely gonna make a review in a few weeks after i've kind of used it tested it or took it through its paces and stuff but this is an awesome deck so i just wanted to say thank you so much to savannah for uh making these decks sending them out they're super awesome i would definitely recommend picking these up the stocks are always super limited 
So make sure that you uh, stay on. Uh, they usually come out on Saturdays at noon. So definitely an awesome board, and I'm so glad I was able to get to ride it. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.